Hello everybody, my name is Thiago Reis from ST Microelectronics and we are here at ST Developers Conference 2019. Today I'm going to show you the sensor tile dot box. Our latest evaluation tool for sensors and connectivity is a ready-to-go IoT node based on an IP54 uh, plastic case. So from a look inside, the sensor tile dot box features the latest sensors from ST Microelectronics. So our six-axis IMU, the LSM6 DSO-X, we have featured two accelerometers, one extremely low power, the LIS-2DW12, and as well our high-performance inclinometer, LIS-3DHH, based on a ceramic package 5 by 5 millimeters. We also included in this package the LIS-2MDL, our standalone magnetometer. We also included quite a few environmental sensors within the sensor tile dot box, which basically features our LPS-22HH, our altimeter pressure sensor, an absolute pressure sensor based on a fully molded technology in terms of packaging, uh, our temperature sensor, the STTS-751, our humidity and temperature sensor combo, the HTS-221, and finally, but not the least, our analog bottom port microphone, MP23ABS1. On top of the sensors, the platform benefits from a very high-performance microcontroller, yet low power, the STM32L4 series, plus BLE connectivity with the SPBTLE-1S device. Additionally, the part is battery-powered, so you can find a 500 milliamp hour battery at the back of the sensor tile dot box, and the battery is charged with the STBC02 uh, battery charging technology from ST Microelectronics. Okay. So specifically talking about the sensor tile dot box and why it is the most powerful platform for sensor evaluation within ST, it is because it supports three different levels of expertise, from entry to expert and professional level of developers. So entry level mode, there is no need for programming. You are basically going to evaluate predefined features that are commonly used and defined uh, by the market. So for example, pedometer, barometer, data logging, compass and level detection with the inclinometer, vibration monitoring, asset tracking, and even the upcoming baby crying detection based on the STM32Cube.ai. Uh, the sensor tile dot box also has the expert mode that allows you through the mobile app graphical user interface to set up uh, and create, not only in terms of customization, what sensors are going to be used, but also create custom application visually uh, based on the mobile app interface. And then, finally, but not the least, we have the pro working mode, which is basically where you're going to write C code within the sensor tile dot box. So again, with, with the three uh, operational modes, we can enable or we can allow a user, regardless of the air level of expertise, to evaluate and understand better sensors from entry to expert and professional modes. So now as a demo, let's start looking at the entry level experience with the sensor tile dot box. So you set up your hardware, in this case I'm powering via USB cable, and you open the STBLE sensor app. You hit create a new app, and in this case, these are the available example apps that I just mentioned in the introduction portion. So let's take, for example, the barometer. The barometer app has data over BLE. This is why you find the BLE icon right here at the top. In case you're logging data into the micro SD card, also in the entry level, the data, the symbol of the micro SD card will be listed accordingly. So taking the barometer example, I click on upload and then I find PIO2, which is my sensor tile dot box evaluation, and I hit play. I will overwrite the firmware that is available on board. The mobile app will update the firmware accordingly to my uh, selection. And the STBLE sensor app is telling me that the app loading happened correctly. So it's ready to go. It's going to give me back to the selection of the devices. So I'll select the TIO2, which is the board that I have. So now I can see uh, quite a few sensor data. So in this case, I'm seeing temperature and pressure data, as well as humidity data. So if I want to visualize and plot data for example, temperature sensor data uh, with the sensor tile dot box, you can enable to the left-hand menu and click on plot data. From here, you can select the different sensor available on the sample application and perform the logging. 
In case you want to log and actually register that data for use, uh, to, in order to use it later, just click Start Logging on the top right hand corner of the app. And this will allow you, the mobile app interface itself, to log the data into CSV files. Once you stop logging, the app will ask you if you want to send an email with the log files. If you hit OK, you get an email with the log, with the log data of the available sensors that you selected. So another interesting demo or user experience that you can have with the sensor tile.box is the sensor fusion experience. So here, we are showcasing the cube which basically has accelerometer and gyroscope data. So as I move the board, the cube moves accordingly. You can also visualize throughout through the STBLE sensor app, uh, not only the data, but also you can perform cloud logging. So for example, in case you want to set up or log your data, your sensor data into a cloud service, the STBLE sensor app also allows you to explore that functionality. All right, so thank you for your attention. For more information on the sensor tile box, please visit at c.com slash sensor tile box. Thank you very much and have a great day.